Your growth will start with you, and most importantly, the AUC unity will start with you. So we all get together, we do this chant, it starts with you, it starts with me, we all rep in the AUC. It starts with you, it starts with me. We As all the chant states, it does start with you and me. As people, we perhaps have our own ways to bring us together. In historical times of strife and struggle, the olive branch was a common approach to heal social scars. It served as a symbol of reconciliation, a symbol of goodwill, and to the Atlanta University Center, a symbol of peace. In this same spirit, students in the AUC carved a new path in the orientation experience to gain assurance that their peers in neighboring institutions were friends and not foes. In light of past social challenges between AUC schools, student leadership comes together annually to nurture a program to advocate a culture of coherence, collaboration, and most of all, unity. Well, as a Morehouse student, we share uh, our campus with two other uh, universities, well, Spelman College, Clark Atlanta University, and AUC Unity is combining all the students together in a way that is uh, imperative for the matriculation of all three students. We don't really interact with uh, with women unless it's at the other institution, so unity is very important. And I believe the 2015 class will change the stigma that Clark Atlanta girls and Spelman girls cannot get together. We are all black men and women trying to change the world. We are all trying to make a difference and we are all trying to empower our brothers and sisters. There is no reason that we as leaders cannot get along. Being unified and having all of us together uh, can really create change and let everybody else know what we're really doing in Atlanta. Yeah, I think that we have it very good because at this point, they're trying to get us all to come together and be one and a unity and respect each other and get along so we can help each other grow and help other people grow. More classes that are gonna come in after us, like they're gonna need us to be their mentors and show them the way and make it happen. I think this is a really good thing and I've never even experienced anything like this before. It's emerge and overcome our overcome our differences in the quest for common goals. At the end of the day, we're an HBCU community, and it's important for us to uplift and inspire each other no matter what we're doing, whether we're going to medical school, whether we're in undergrad, whether we're doing fashion design at Clark. We're all one, and we're all working towards a common goal. So it's really important to uplift each other, inspire each other, and really work off of each other and, and, and motivate each other to do the best we can do. You are an amazing group of students, and we expect amazing things from you and it starts this evening as we join together as one community in the Atlanta University Center Consortium. Um, I love our interaction. I think that it's slowly starting to progress and we're all starting to get closer to each other. I think it's so important because we all carry so much different tradition and now we're starting to combine it and work as a whole. At that moment, we were looking not only at unconditional brotherhood, but also unconditional sisterhood. I went to an HBCU in undergrad. I went to Norfolk State University. And I was close to another HBCU, Hampton University, that a lot of people know about. And we had nothing like this, even though we were uh, neighboring and sistering um, HBCUs. And I believe it's important to definitely have that type of camaraderie and unity between black schools, because we as a people need to help each other to get along. Thank you. There are things out there in the world that we need to fight, and we need to fight it together, change the world together, and it starts with the AUC. Knowing the power of unity, all of us should stay together. If any misunderstandings arise, they must be talked out without beating or shading our sister and brother institutions.